apply for example this wizard over here randomly boosts thrill fun and cuteness so definitely this is quite cool and they will basically pass my ride and they'll say oh what a cool thing so i'm gonna jump in over here so that's how you're gonna be able to make them spend even more and more cash out of it okay so right now i'm gonna go and buy a deluxe over here with 200 gemstones so as you can see guaranteed reward one reward of the least so let's gonna go and consume the gemstones over here and let's see what we're gonna get so come on okay i got this one this is a common okay gemstones yeah i need gemstones okay a rare one okay this one i need to start up a bit and let's see what Welcome guys to Idle Games TV and we're gonna check out Overcrowded Tycoon obviously on Idle Games TV YouTube channel. So basically you're gonna have a park that you will have a lot of smiley faces let's say like that that will get angry guys don't forget about that so you're gonna have the offline income only for one hour so definitely not that cool but uh, let's hope that uh, you will enter this game as fast as you can you're gonna have different kind of uh, events that you can join in order for you to unlock new and new things so let's jump into it so you're gonna have the main entrance over here basically in the main entrance you can upgrade the ticket price you can upgrade the uh, basically the bus size so how many smiley faces from the bus will get off in order for them to enter your park and obviously you will be able to un uh, basically upgrade the bus frequency so how fast will the bus come so not that hard at first this one you do need to upgrade it uh, really really often so you're gonna have different kind of attractions over here as you can see you're gonna have different kind of statues that will offer you different kind of boots we're gonna get into that afterwards so this is gonna be where you're gonna start you're gonna have over here the possibility to basically unlock a builder's hut so you do want to have at least two in order for you to be able to construct different kind of attractions definitely quite cool try to put like this one over here the wishing well if you're gonna get it try to put it at the entrance in order for uh, every every smiley face over here every visitor to pass it and they're gonna drop some coins and you're gonna be able to collect it now we're gonna get into the mascot stuff and so on so you do need to put real money in the game if you want a uh, faster advancement like for example some parts in the park require you to obviously put real cash uh, the the slots are quite blocked so that's quite bad but definitely give this game a try if you're a fan of these idle games because this is a quite quite good one so you're gonna have as i mentioned different kind of rides now for example the rides this one is at maximum capacity and you're gonna be able to increase the ticket price obviously increase the seat so how many customers will you have the queue length so how many of your customers will be able to stay in the queue and as you can see the red ones over here are quite mad due to the fact that they stayed too much in the line so they got mad to, to that fact and they will go and basically what they're gonna do at the end of the park if they're gonna exit and still be mad they're gonna basically steal your money not steal but basically they will ask for a refund every time so watch out for that now you do not want to have angry angry passengers in your park that's the idea that's why it's called overcrowded you do not want to have red faces so every time watch out for that basically you do need to put some statues that will increase their happiness increase uh, their uh, fun part and so on so like for example this wizard over here randomly boosts thrill fun and cuteness so definitely this is quite cool watch out for these mascots and watch out where you're gonna put them obviously try to put them somewhere around the attractions the uh, the things that will uh, basically uh, make angry your customers over here now different kind of customers will have the like button on their head so basically that's a quest as well you will see that every six hours you will have different kind of quests that you need to complete in order for you to complete that you will need to basically collect uh, 50 or 60 likes uh, also uh, sell some food also sell tickets and so on so the quests will quite change and from those quests you're going to be able to unlock a chest and from that chest you're going to be able to collect cards and with those cards obviously you're going to be able to start up your specific attraction so quite cool 
now let's get into the chest part so over here at the entrance you will see a chest box uh, it has a cooldown period of five hours if i'm not mistaken the first one will be free the one with the basic the one with the 50 gemstones over there try to unlock it first one for free as i mentioned and the other one you can watch and add and you will get another chest right now i'm gonna go and buy a deluxe over here with 200 gemstones so as you can see guaranteed reward one reward of the list so let's gonna go and consume the gemstones over here and let's see what we're gonna get so come on okay i got this one this is a common okay gemstones yeah i need gemstones okay a rare one okay this one i need to start up a bit and let's see what do i get over here guys tiki splash okay so i don't know if i build this one or not but definitely i can start it up so one more wait wait epic cool and i got a new mascot a hero shield hands out hero shields protects against nausea so definitely you have a problem with nausea due to the fact that uh, you're gonna see some of your uh, customers will puke basically and you do want to decrease their nausea in order for you to uh, not have those problems so you're gonna go over here uh, where you can see the red dot and you're gonna go into the mascot part over here and as you can see i didn't unlock them all but i do need to put this guy over here so let's go and hit place and i'm gonna put him at the end guys try to put your mascot at the end of the park so at uh, when he's gonna basically exit and i'm gonna try to put him over here at the exit point not you not you my friend sorry my bad you come on over here place and i'm gonna place him over here right in order for me to actually not have a red uh, uh, let's say red uh, customers and uh, one more trick that you do want to control so basically you want guys to control your uh, customers basically where do you want them to go so in order for me to actually try to push them to enter this track i build different kind of things on the road as you can see over here and they will basically pass my ride and they'll say oh what a cool thing so i'm gonna jump in over here so that's how you're gonna be able to make them spend even more and more cash out of it okay so it's not gonna be that card just to try to basically move your uh, uh, the trees uh, and uh, different kind of decorations that you have in order for you to force your uh, your customers to go on different kind of rides you do want to do that now right over here this one is ready to evolve because i have the cards i will hit evolve and basically consume that high amount uh, definitely you can upgrade this one before uh, it's up to you uh, if you want to take one out so you can see you can stash it in your inventory and put a different kind of ride over here so basically the common ones uh, from time to time you do want to uh, change them this one requires me 31 million so definitely quite a lot but i do need to gather them uh, you're gonna have over here besides the first chest so let's go back a bit guys let's go back you're gonna have the big cinema over here uh, this one definitely watch all of those ads so the first one will be free and afterwards you do need to watch up to four ads now from time to time uh, i saw that there's a glitch regarding this part so most probably the next four ads will not be four will be five because i saw that uh, at least one every time will not uh, get uh, counted so i do need to watch two ads for a specific uh, uh, thing for a specific reward over here now from time to time you're gonna see that this one has a cooldown for six hours one hour three hours whatever just keep in mind that you need to come in the game in order for you to watch that because that's definitely gonna be helpful over here if you're gonna invite uh, some friends like for real send invitations on whatsapp on facebook or whatever you're going to be able to unlock this attraction and obviously you're going to be able to get more customers over here so definitely quite cool now as i mentioned you will have some slots that are basically uh, stuck so you will not be able to put uh, attractions only with real cash like for example these ones that have stars on them this over here i cannot put only with real money so it's up to you if you're gonna put real money the game is quite interesting as i mentioned so you're gonna have food as well so you're gonna have burger you're gonna have ice cream popcorn and other things as well as long as you're gonna go and play you're gonna see that you're gonna be able to unlock new and new uh, basically shops over here so definitely try this game if you're a fan of it obviously different kind of services toilets picnic tables obviously put some toilets please because they will get angry if they will not have uh, 
they will let us have toilets obviously picnic tables in order for them to take a rest uh, every once in a while because definitely they do want to enjoy the time over here try to arrange them really really cool so for example this one this business mogul one okay so plus 20 percent attraction ticket price this one doesn't have a circle around it but guys check this thing out so as you can see the highly evolved one plus 20 percent attraction ticket price in that area so watch out where you're gonna put different kind of statues because some of them offer you different kind of uh, possibilities the ones that do not have the circle you can put them everywhere you want but the ones that uh, basically have a circle around them will uh, give you different kind of boosts like for example this one uh, basically offers me plus 75 percent food stand price so definitely i need to put one something like this sorry somewhere around my uh, food shops in order for them to ask for a higher price regarding the food say cheese okay plus 30 percent ticket price area quite cool so obviously if you're going to be able to unlock uh, different kind of attractions basically they will start up as well the the statues so definitely give this game a try as i mentioned so the food part will have a maximum amount after a while but please try to max them out in order for you to do what in order for you to basically get as many ca as much cash as you can from the food part because definitely that will be quite helpful you can put even more 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 food stores depending on you you can even try to build a park with only food and that's gonna be quite cool I will try to build one over here now guys regarding the firework festival uh, every six hours you're gonna be able to uh, watch an ad and you're gonna spin a wheel and you're gonna get a specific multiplier depending on your luck and from that you're gonna be able to basically uh, get for the next uh, one minute two minute or depending on how much uh, cash did you spend on this one uh, coin sorry not cash not real cash you're gonna be able to increase the duration that's what i'm trying to say and you're gonna get a specific multiplier regarding that duration from your income in the park so definitely try to activate this one as fast as you can as i mentioned try to collect some likes as you can see you're gonna have red likes as well so basically that guy is quite 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 excited now i do need to build an attraction over here because definitely they have nothing over here so i do want to build something now guys you're going to be able to expand your park further and further you're going to be able to unlock even more and more uh, attractions over here as you can see quite 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 a lot uh, definitely you can put real money you can get different kind of attractions from the events as well so please try to play this game and if you have played it and reach further please let us know in the comments below how further did you reach and obviously if you have uh, let's say different kind of tips regarding this game please let us know uh, uh, in the comments below how further did you reach now guys until next time take care don't forget to subscribe please hit that like button and please try to do some comments regarding other idle games that you want to see over here on this channel until next time take care guys bye